Right guys, I'm going to be trying something different. Welcome, by the way, everybody. Um, the Affinity missions, though not integral to the story, do help pad out and help you understand some of the characters and yada 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 yada. So I'm going to be doing these separate to my standard episodes, which are just going to be story based. And I will try and... Um, well, compile these together, because I don't know how long they're going to be, how short they're going to be. If they're going to be resulting in about an hour of gameplay, that'll be one episode. If they're pretty short, then I'll merge a few together. If I can. I don't know. I'm still working out this bloody capture software I've got. Anyway, let's uh, crack on. <clears throat> I'm finally getting the hang of life on Mira. In fact, the other day, I... Wait, you look like I'm babbling. Why are you even here? Oh, I get it. You must have seen that posting on Mission Control, right? Gar? My apologies. It's nice to meet you. I'm Fog Kristoff. I'm a little surprised, actually. There's a mess, mate. I don't think anyone would accept my request. This is the best thing that's happened to me all month. Yeah, that'd be nice. Okay. Thanks for letting me take this at my own pace. You're very patient. I finally got my thoughts together. Let me explain the mission. Basically. Some of the data probes installed by the Pathfinders have been acting up. Yarrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrr
fucking gorgeous. I do just keep gushing about this. Um, I see flying testicles. And level 45 crab demon. You stay there, crab demon. You stay the fuck there. That's, uh, oh, archaeological level 3 will screw you. That was it, I was supposed to speak to, um, oh, I can't remember her name. Kailana or something like that? Blondie, anyway. You stay there, Krabby. I'm just gonna run round. Oh, oh, you just disappeared. That's fine. Bye bye, floating testicles. You have fun. Ooh. Oh, go away, piggies. seem to be able to handle yourself, my dear boy. I'm rather impressed. <laughs> also, do excuse my stuffiness and my throat sounding horrible. I'm still getting over a cold. Obviously, those who've been following my Rodea and Metroid Prime playthroughs will know of that. Shout to Piggy. Bye bye, Piggy. But a cold will not stop me from recording or enjoy myself with these wonderful bloody games. Go away, piggies. No! It's times like these you want to be extremely powerful so you can just swap at them with a fucking back of your end. Shit. Hey, go on, Let's break your little. I don't know. It, it, it's a puss sack, I think. Or it's a shroom. I don't know. Anyway, you did. So, uh, death, more than likely. <sighs> I'm just hoping my laptop isn't struggling with all of this recording I've been doing. Yay, Oblivia! Where you come to die. Oh shit! Okay, stuff at level 17 and 18. Oh. Oh, that music. Oh, look at you. Oh, you're a gorgeous unicorn. Run, unicorn, run! As long as you're not called Charlie. Get up there and activate that. 
probe in place. Start opening up the map a little bit. It's a shame I can't really show you guys what's going on on the map. Hmm. Um. No, we're not going to risk it. Sham can't ride one of those. This, oh, this music. Oh, off to go fix the data probe. Doodly do. Level 27. Um, you stay out of the way, buddy. Yeah. Okay, no, don't, don't walk towards the very data probe I'm off to go fix. No, T turn around. Son of a bitch. Right, well, I'm going to go install my own probe over here. Hopefully he'll move. Good, he's moved. Stay over there. Clearly, someone's hmm, dug it up. Strange. This isn't what I expected to see. Why is this one sitting here? Well, that explains the problem, but not the cause. Let's try another site. Oh, you're a nice variation on the design. I'm surprised you haven't noticed me, mind you. Anyway, oh, now we did. Damn awesome. No, oh, don't die on me now, Elmer. You keep doing that. Also, Drew's gonna turn down the TV a little bit. And again. We're not, we're not that much of a fight, are you? Hmm? Poor Grex. He had strapped his arms. Also, a heads up to you guys who are coming in just for the affinity missions. I do normally do all of my grinding off camera. So this is sort of a oh shit moment and I shouldn't have to be killing all of these wonderful creatures. Oh, another one gets involved. Thanks, buddy. Oh, he's only a level 20, that's sir. I was I almost saw he was a level 30 then. Oh, and the sun's coming up. Oh, that's getting bright. Go down, go down. Give me my aura. Thank you. I do feel bad for taking on most of these creatures. Am I 
taking damage because of the heat. I am, aren't I? Holy shit. Holy, that is awesome. Oh, I think we are going to struggle at this rate, guys. Okay, we're going to run. Or fail. That's cool. <clears throat> that was a rather cheeky achievement. I'll try harder next year. Thanks. Ooh, stay away. Ah, oh, one of my favorite designs yet again. I did see the ones in Primordia and Noctilum, but it's nice to see such a variation because he's now in a desert. He looks so dried up. Looks like we've got no what? Uh, no. Run. Just run. Stay there. Thank you. Oh, heart attack. Should pop over there because that'll be a warp point. Fast travel, whichever. Floaty rocks. Do look forward to finding out about the reason for that. Oh, good. Oh. And another reason why I want to be recording the Affinity Missions is the fact that they're voice acted. Whereas the rest of them aren't all the standard missions, gather well, obviously gathering quests. How the hell can you do that? You're adorable. Oh, how cute are you. Anyway, I'm going to run away. I don't want to fight you. You're too adorable. But yes, as you've heard with um, Falk. They are voice acted, which is quite impressive because in Xenoblade Chronicles, the only other mission that was voice acted that wasn't part of the main story was one to do with, what's her name now? She was, um, she was one of the high end here anyway, a bloody psycho bitch at that. But I'm pretty sure it's the only other mission that was ever voice acted. Strength comes from experience. That's true on any part. Doodly 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 doo. Somebody pulling these up. Must be. This probe's been pulled out of the ground as well. It's like something is going around and intentionally digging them up, or something. Let's head for the next site. How far are you making us go out? That's the question. So now we're going east, northeast a bit. What? Oh, no, 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 no. Insta-kill. Thank you! Insect crab. Um, Gollum? Hello, another one. You, you keep going that way. Oh shit. Also, I apologise if I ever get cut off on the loading screens. It's only when it first starts up. And then, I think it's like, put that loading bar in, then I'm fine again. I can feel myself getting stronger. Uh, 
55. Oh, ganglion. Motherfuckers. Um, shit. I've just walked it on something. Motherfuckers. Right, um... I'm going to see if I've got a warp point. Oh, so I do. It's been pulled up again. Oh no, we never even put it back. Um... There's no way I'm going to be able to take on a level 27. You keep walking. Keep walking. Go on. Oh, there we go. <laughs> this one's pulled out of the ground just like the others. Huh? Huh, you're right. This is where we start. Apologies, that's my mistake. My brother was always yelling at me to focus. He used to say the only mistakes I made were stupid ones. Guess I haven't made much progress on that front. No, don't be so hard on yourself, Fog. Hmm. Yes. You're very kind. I'll add this to the list of mistakes I mull over in my head before going to sleep. Come on, Fog. Okay. Well, there's nothing else for us here. Let's head to our actual destination. Up north a bit? Seeing as I was a little confused. No, south. Well, I seem to have a fast travel for it, so... Boop! Seems that it's actually the safer course of action at the minute. Yeah, it's alright, testicle turkey. Oh, I'm not going to like this, am I? Ah! You motherfuckers, that's why. That explains it. The ganglion have been digging them up. And here I thought a hundred meter worm was forcing them up as it burrowed. I'm almost disappointed. <laughs> Let's see if you're up for it. Well, if I'm being honest, I'd like to turn around and go home. Yeah, I suppose that's not really a solution, huh? If we let them go, the damage will spread. And who knows when we'll find them again. Let's do it. Together, we should almost definitely be okay. Alright. You wanna be that brave? Oh, they're only level. 12 and a level 14, that's alright. See now, personally, I don't see an issue with some of the mechanics in this, I know there was a couple of reviews bitching about it. Ah, um, alright, cheeky git. Oh no, that's why. 
Thanks, buddy. I was thinking that I wouldn't be taken down that easily by them. And that fucking brute just came out of nowhere. Where are you? You fucker. Let's try again. This episode is now being lengthened by uh, terrible, terrible quantities. <laughs> You're just going to run around in circles, aren't you? Stay over there, you gargantuan bastard. Now you guys go for him. So I presume this is another species roped in to help out the ganglion. You just get your asses kicked. Oh, there's one almost down. Come on. Ooh, got another TP ability. Flex beam attacks. Boost beam damage. Nice. Now be another aura. Ooh. So close to screwing that one up. Tired mostly. It's been ages since I fought like that. Still, I'm glad it's over. And you made it possible, so thanks. Victory raisins! Almost like being by my brother's side again. Maybe even better in a way. It's actually kind of odd to feel this comfortable with a stranger. Hmm. Very kind of you. It's been ages since anyone counted on me for anything. I'm pretty sure the last time was when I was 21 and Fry had me buy his scotch. I'm always on my own, so I can join you most any time. Nice. And look at that, only half an hour. Hmm. I think we can squeeze in another affinity mission. Winged Viper, well... You know what? Look how adorable you are! Yep. Just want to get a good look at his face. It's a big kitty cat! Oh, it's a kitty cat! Or a raccoon, or a raccoon cat, or something. Aww. What are 
at you. Oh, yeah. I'm just going to go set up another probe over here, and then I'll go have a look for another affinity mission. Hopefully. Oh, Meronium deposit. And I farted. No, we're not. Right. Tell you what, guys. Give me a mo, and I will meet you on the next Affinity mission. Renewed will.
Right guys, knew I'd find it. Here it is, Renewed Will. Now this is going to be one that will allow me to access more of the story. So hopefully it doesn't affect anything going on too much. But I thought I'd go for this one just to get out of the way. Hopefully I've been able to make a good enough edit so it looks like I knew where I was going. Does it? Oh. All right, sorry, Fog. No. Off duty today, Arena? Finally. I love my team, but we're together 24-7. I thought it'd be nice to grab a bite by myself, but, uh... You realized eating alone is kind of pathetic? Well, that's not exactly how I'd put it. Too sad and lonely to eat? Tatsu can definitely help Arena there. Tatsu is happy to chew and swallow food for Arena's sake. Okay, Tatsu, now you've been a bit bizarre. You travel with quite the cast of characters, Colonel. Well, if it ain't Arena. That's Lieutenant Arena to you. She was a real big shot back on Earth, remember? Hey, she's Blade now. Same as us. Just another lowly stinking grunt. No better than you or me. Ain't You're a complete like asshole or something. <laughs> something like that. Ah, hey, now that ain't fair. Think about it. She does pretty damn well with the hand she was dealt. Even saddled with losers like Gwen. Her team manages to pull off a mission now and then. <sighs> Pair of assholes. Leave it, Arena. They aren't worth the effort. Yes, ma'am. See that? She's like a cute little puppy. All trained and everything. Yeah, you're right. Elma calls the shots now. Her and that freak show she calls a team. Beauty and the Beasts. <laughs> right? Listen, Elma. When you're ready to have a real man serve under you, call me, okay? Yeah, you're probably gonna end up eaten by a fucking I was going to let you two mouth cat. Off this time. But talking trash about my team and the Colonel? No way. It's time for a lesson. Oh, baby. A private lesson? Oh, this ought to be good. Let's go. Mm. I don't know. Oh, you want some too? Come on. Didn't know you were such a hothead. I like it. No, I was gonna back you up. Oh! This isn't. I mean, we just—they started it. Pathetic bullshit. I saw the whole thing, including where you picked a fight that was about to get your teeth kicked in. Get your skinny little asses back to the barracks. Your tongues have an appointment with some toilet seats. I just can't deal with men like that. Ugh. You okay? Just forget it. <laughs> hmm? Why do you ask? Friend want to say Arena acting like weirdo, but not have tact like... <laughs> <sighs> right. I'll be fine. I get it. And don't worry. 
We can talk about it later, when Tatsu isn't around. Lindley! Lindley Cruel! Let's just drop it, okay? The commander didn't come all this way to hear my problems. Yeah, we did. Actually, I came looking for you, Alma. A new mission? Yeah. Some local indigents causing a ruckus over on the Grieving Plains. Ooh. It ain't pretty. Lost a few prospectors already. Christ. We're on it. Colonel, I I'd like to join you, if that's all right. Well, of course you can. You're off duty today. I need to blow off some steam. And besides, I miss working with the Colonel. All right. We can always use another soldier of your caliber on the team. Thank you, ma'am. Hmm. Let's try not to get our asses kicked this time. So, it's in Primordia, uh, not too far. Right. Biddly biddy boob. Oh god, no, 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 because things around here like to try and kill me. Ooh, casual collector. Well. Come on then. Let's go find out what these creatures are. Let's know ever those, whatever the hell those are. No. No. Oh, oh, it's testicle birds. Okay then. I laugh at you. So your crown's broken. Sham can't break your testicles. And I was supposed to be a gizzard, just like a chicken or a turkey, but they are just far too well defined to be anything else. Oh no, he's dead. That's fine. It is a bit weird because you can turn around and say that you have actually kicked someone in the bollocks. And not actually having to kick someone in said bollocks. There we go. Friends kicking butts today. Of course we are. Hmm. Strange. Right? Hmm? Friends saying Tatsu is strange? Well, we know that. But besides that, these creatures don't really seem powerful enough to have caused blade casualties. Exactly. The commander wouldn't send your team all the way out here just for this. We must be missing something. Elma here. 
Go ahead. Sam, we have an emergency. Another team is under attack near your location. Ooh. Yeah, on the way. Things up. Majorly. You would think after being here for two months, some of these blades would actually have a bit of strength behind them. No, no, I, I wake up and here I am kicking ass. May as well while I'm here. Holy shit. No. Um, I think I know why people are under attack. Now he has a single testicle on his back. Serves them right. Seriously? Those guys? That's enough. Now let's get in there and take that thing down. Yes, ma'am. Should've like Diablos from Mon Diablos from Monster Hunter that's evolved a bit more. So, uh, you lads, with all your talk, I mean absolutely fuck all. Ooh. That's old boss's tail. Let's try and get his horn. There we go. Oh, no, you don't, Lynn. Don't. No, 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 no. Nope, Lynn's down. Bloody hell, Lynn. Supposed to be better than this. Ah. I'm not complaining. Wow. I. Uh, you really saved our bacon there. Thanks. It's fine. Situations like this are exactly what we're here for, after all. But you two better train harder. But you're gonna keep running into trouble everywhere you go here. Yeah, no, you're right. Hey, about the other day, I'm sorry. We didn't mean anything by it. I said it's fine already. Just get home in one piece. R right. Little sissy bitches. Ugh, it's almost worse when they apologize. Yeah, well. I'm sorry too. Hmm? What for? When I, you know, hesitated to help them out. Oh, that? No worries. Honestly, I was thinking the same thing. What? You were? Sure I was. A jerk is still a jerk, even if it's your job to save them. Harsh, but fair. Hmm. I still can't believe how quick you jumped in to help. Well, we're the only humans on this rock. Our future depends on all of us, even the dirtbags. 
if you look at it that way, it was a pretty easy decision. Anyway, thanks, Colonel. My head feels a lot clearer now. I appreciate you letting me tag along. Anytime, soldier. All right, let's get back to New LA. Woohoo! What I'm actually starting to really like these affinity missions, they're short and sweet. Yeah, that's... Ooh. And obviously getting extra skills. Nice. Right, well, uh, I'll leave it here for now. to the sun there we go anyway guys thank you very much hopefully the affinity missions are going to be this sort of length so i can keep putting these episodes out alongside the standard episodes now which i will be able to now go and make a sixth episode <laughs> but yes hopefully you guys have enjoyed i haven't bored you too much and i do hope you'll join us for next time so thank you very much again and take care.